Hello, I'm Dr Ferguson, Dermatology Consultant at St George's Hospital. In this video, I'm going to give you some information about eczema in children and what causes it. This information shouldn't replace what you've been told by your specialist, which will be tailored to your child. Eczema is very common. It affects one in five children in the UK. It's a skin condition which causes redness and itchiness, itching being the primary problem. It usually starts in childhood and often lasts into adulthood. Children with eczema may develop red rashes, often on their arms and legs, but the pattern can vary depending on the age of the child. Eczema is typically episodic, which means your child may have weeks or months where their skin is relatively calm and clear, followed by flares where their skin becomes itchy and red. Atopic eczema is the most common type of eczema, and if close family members have asthma, hay fever, or food allergies, then your child is more likely to develop eczema. Eczema is caused by a combination of genetics and environmental factors. Healthy skin is made of lots of cells cemented together, helped by natural moisturizing factors. This stops unwanted infections and chemicals from getting in and water from getting out. Children with eczema have a genetic tendency to dry skin, even though eczema is much more than just dry skin. Their skin is missing important natural moisturizing factors so that it's weaker and more leaky. This causes redness and itchiness, which leads to scratching and can promote a vicious cycle of itching and scratching. Eczema is very uncomfortable for children and it can impact on many aspects of their life, such as their sleep, school attendance and self-esteem. Six out of 10 children will outgrow eczema by their teenage years but most will have a tendency to dry skin for their whole life, and many will have eczema as adults. Children with more severe eczema and those with a strong family history of it are less likely to outgrow it. We aim to support you and your child to effectively control your child's symptoms so that their eczema interferes with your day-to-day -day lives as little as possible.